What's up guys, we're back with another WTF and this week we're talking about sugar again. It seems to be the popular topic. But first, make sure you like, subscribe, comment, algorithm, you know the drill. What happens if you quit sugar for one week? What will happen if you quit all forms of sugar just for one week? One, your face will become more toned. Up wait, 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 wait. Your face will become more toned. Your face will become more toned. Your jawline will be sharp and face will be no dullness or puffiness. You get a sharp jawline, reduce puffiness. Bro, you're like 140 pounds soaking wet. That's why you have a toned jawline. It's not because you don't eat sugar. The dude's face may be two times taller than it is wide. I mean, that's, I mean, it's impressive, I suppose you do have a very sharp jawline, but that's because you're really skinny. Your jawline was sharp before you quit sugar. Also, he did a really good like blue steel from Zoolander. He's like, insert clip of Ben Stiller walking by Owen Wilson. Thank you, you're welcome. You will feel more energetic because your body will inflammation less in your body and because you're eating whole foods, it will give you consistent energy rather than giving you sugar crash. Okay, so it's going to give you more energy. Um, I don't know if you know what the definition of energy is, but sugar, which contains glucose, is literally energy. It contains energy. So this idea that sugar is going to make you crash is just not supported by the scientific research. And as we've discussed multiple times, it is not going to increase inflammation independent of a caloric surplus. Three, you will have a clear and a glowing skin. Aapke mm. acne, pimples, or skin allergies kam ho jayegi. Ye sabhi skin problems hoti hai. Bro, I eat like 100 grams of sugar a day, along with like 50, 60 grams of fiber, and I, I, I have clear skin. Oh, could it be just because I'm a middle-aged male who doesn't really get acne? First off, there's no evidence to support what you're saying that I'm aware of. Didn't know you were a skin expert, and again, you're a middle-aged dude. I get a pimple here and there, but most middle-aged dudes I know aren't like breaking out all over the place. Four, your immunity will get high. It means you will be less because your organs will work properly. Oh, better, better organ function. Yeah, once again, I don't know if you know this, sir, but organs actually function on glucose and sugar. And when you consume any form of carbohydrate, it turns into what? Sugar in the bloodstream. Are you basically saying you should just eat a low carb diet? Again, I'm not saying you should eat a bunch of sugar. That's not what I'm saying. I'm just saying the reasons that this guy is stating that low sugar diets work are not why they work. If you lose weight, all these things he's talking about tend to improve. So it's not because you're eating less sugar. It's because you're eating less calories. Now, cutting out foods high in sugar that are ultra processed, hyper palatable, energy dense, easy to overconsume, is a great way to lose weight but it's not because of some inherent property to sugar. And that's all I got. There's more points, but I really can't be bothered to go back and watch anymore because it's just so dumb that I'm over my threshold for this week. I'm out.